My name is Steve Rosen. I have several titles at City of Hope. I'm the Provost, Chief Scientific Officer, Director of the Beckman Research Institute and Cancer Center. My own research is focused on developing new therapies for blood cancers. This is an institution that provides the finest care for patients with cancer. In addition, we have major research initiatives as well as uh, studies in stem cell biology and regenerative medicine. My name is Jane Worth, and I was diagnosed with acute lymphocytic leukemia on August 13th, 2007. There was a clinical trial going on at City of Hope that fit exactly my type of leukemia, and I fit all the criteria. And so I came down here to try and get back into remission so I could get a bone marrow transplant. Could not believe how kind everyone was, how welcoming. I truly feel that the clinical trial saved my life. My name is Sean Givens, and I was diagnosed with uh, cancer with CLL, chronic lymphatic leukemia, in uh, March of 2016. The support here has been amazing. It's cancer is not something any, anyone wants, but this has been a phenomenal experience for me. City of Hope has always prided itself, and I know all my colleagues and the staff feel the same way, that we're not just treating a disease. We are treating a human being who happens to have a cancer. Dr. Rosen, his personal care that he gave me, his, his the kindness was, I couldn't walk away from that. He was the guy, he was my doctor. My name is Natalie Schneidman. I'm the Director of Operations for the Department of Supportive Care Medicine at City of Hope. Immerman Angels is a perfect complement to our program because they provide the one thing we can't, that peer support. I heard about Immerman Angels through a friend who had lymphoma and became a mentor for them. And I thought that seemed like a really good thing to do, to share my experience with someone who didn't know because it's kind of scary when you're diagnosed and you don't know. And often, uh, even the most caring of the professionals just does not have the empathy that someone who's actually been affected by a similar process would have. I'm three years out and even now, having that support and someone to talk to who's been there and understands is really important. We can provide the best scientific-based treatment and cures, but if we're not taking care of that whole person and that whole family, we'll never get the outcomes that we want to get. I feel privileged to be recognized by Immerman Angels. I recognize the importance of their work. I, I understand the large number of patients and families they've benefited and the commitment they have to making an impact, to improving the lives of individuals who've had to uh, contend with a diagnosis of cancer.